This is my last video cooking in this kitchen. Next few weeks, I'm working on my transition plan, moving back to Penang, Malaysia, my hometown. I'll continue to make videos, but I'll be making my videos in Penang. This last video, I'm going to share with you one of the most popular Malaysian Chinese dish. It is called Kam Hyong. Kam Hyong is a Cantonese word. It literally means something that is golden, fragrantly, aromatic dish. Traditionally, it is cooked making use of seafood such as crab, prawns, clams. They are very popular. But I'm going to show you something more simple making at home. I'm going to show you how to make Kam Hyong chicken. Three chicken thigh fillet. I'm going to marinate the chicken with a little bit of salt, a little bit of light soy sauce, add some sesame oil. This is turmeric powder. Gonna use my hand, gonna mix it through. Add a little bit of tapioca flour. Just to coat the chicken, tapioca flour. Gonna use my hand, it's easier. That's the first step is to marinate the chicken. Okay, I'm gonna use some vegetables. I have half a green bell pepper or green capsicum and half a red capsicum here. I'm going to remove the uh, core. Just remove this bit. Then I have the red capsicum. One onion, I'm just going to cut it in half. This one I'm just going to cut it up very very small. So for this one, I'm just going to put it in here, in this one. Now garlic, five cloves of garlic. Going to finely dice the garlic. I'm going to use two bad ice chili, finely dice this up. A bunch of curry leaves. One teaspoon of freshly ground black pepper. This is a curry powder I like to use. It's a Baba's, Malaysian Baba's brand. I'm gonna use this much of curry powder. That's all the preparation. It's a cross between the Chinese, the Malay, and the Indian. A fusion, a true fusion food of Malaysia. Kam Hyong Chicken. I'm just going to sear the chicken on both sides and then I'm going to remove it. I'm not going to cook the chicken right through. Basically to seal the flavour inside the chicken. Now in other videos, there are lots of people that actually deep fry the chicken in their Kam Hyong recipe. As I said, I don't like to deep fry my chicken. I'm just going to sear my chicken. I'm going to lower the heat and remove my chicken. Add the onions and the garlic. Now I'm going to add the curry leaves and the chili. The next thing I'm going to add is the curry powder. I'm going to add some water. Now I'm adding the chicken back in. You can smell the curry powder and the curry leaves. It smells beautiful, aromatic, and it's fragrant. Now if you add dried shrimps, and if you add lemongrass, it's gonna taste different, and it's gonna smell different. Now I'm gonna add the sauce. It's, uh, Oyster sauce. I'm 
and a dark caramel sauce. Sweet dark caramel sauce. The vegetables. And black peppercorn for some heat. Now this dish is a little bit sweet as well, so I'm gonna add some sugar. I'm gonna add brown sugar. One teaspoon of brown sugar. One and a half. Gonna add a bit more water. I'm gonna turn off the heat now. That's all it is. Kam Hyung Chicken. My home version of Kam Hyung Chicken. Golden Fragrant Chicken. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're new to my YouTube channel, remember to subscribe and share with your friends and family. My name is Victor Ku. Thanks for watching and see you back in Penang.